show you guys how to how to upshift display 13 speed. So the main thing is get your clutch and your shifter all moving at the same time. Make sure they're moving in sync. Also, make sure the RPM is not too high when you're shifting. It shifts better between 11 and 14 on all your shifts. Also, if you look at the clutch, you want to make sure you use a ball of your foot on your clutch. That way you're not mashing that clutch all the way to the floor. So use the ball of your foot, keep your toes pointed up, your heel to the floor. Alright, so first shift, I'm going to go from two to three. I'm going to get my hand and my clutch moving at the same time. Let's clutch, clutch. Also, when you're shifting, make sure the clutch comes all the way out. Again, clutch, clutch. Go four to five. Clutch, clutch. Five to six. Clutch, clutch. Notice that I'm shifting kind of fast. You want to make sure that you Get it in gear before the RPM drops below 1100. Clutch, clutch. Okay, any of the gears on the side, make sure that you cuff your hand to the side, push it away from you, come straight back. I'm going to go from 7 to 8. Clutch, clutch. Alright, so now I'm going to demo some downshifting. Okay, in a 13 speed, to downshift one gear, you want to get the RPM down to 1100. That would be one notch above the 10. Okay, when you're downshifting one gear, you want a 300 RPM increase. That means I'm going to rev from 1100 to 14. So I've got the RPM down to 1100. I'm going to clutch it to neutral, rev to 14, clutch it in gear. Here we go. Neutral, rev, clutch. And bring it back down to 1100. Okay, also, when you're downshifting, make sure that you line the shifter up in front of your gear before you rev up. So I'm in seven. I'm going to go to six, which is right here. Go to neutral, find six, rev it up, clutch it in. Okay, fifth gear is going to be straight up. Neutral, rev, clutch. So fourth gear is over to that wall on the right, so I'm going to pull it out of fifth, push it over to the wall, rev it up, clutch it in. At 1100, neutral, rev, close. Alright, four to three, which is straight up. Alright, so now I'm going to start up shifting again. Again, all the gears to the right against the wall, you want to cuff your hand that way. That way you want to push it away from you. If you grab it like this, your body is going to naturally want to pull it to you. So you don't want to do that. You want to push it away from you. I see it all the time. Students will grab it like this trying to go to four when it's over there. Clutch, clutch. Okay, when you go into fifth gear, you want to cuff your hand on this side of it, go to neutral, give a little nudge, and shove it in. Straight down to six, clutch, clutch. And here we go. 
go, eighth gear, it's going to be over there, right? So, cut your hand to the side of it. Clutch, clutch. All right, now I'm going to do seven, five, three. So I'm going to go from eight to seven first to 1100. I'm going to rev to 14. Rev, clutch it in. Go right in at 14. All right, so now I'm gonna I'm gonna double down from seventh gear to fifth gear. Now when you double down, you want to bring it down to 800. If you want to double that 300 increase, which means I'm gonna rev up to 14 also. Down to 800. Pull it out, find the gear, rev it up, clutch the end. Alright, now I'm going to go 5 to 3. Anytime you're skip shifting, you want to bring the RPM down to 800. Down to 800. Pull it out of fifth, push it over, grab it up, clutch it in. Alright, I'm going to start up shifting again. Three to four, I'm going to push it away from me. Clutch, clutch. Go fifth, clutch, clutch. Straight back. 